facts, one of the best things about 4-H, and sometimes one of the most confusing things. Hi, I'm Carla Hightower, 4-H Youth Development Agent for the Meredith District, and this is 4-H Explained. In this series, we are going to talk about different things about 4-H, and today, the topic is projects. So, join us as we explore Kansas 4-H projects in 4-H Explained. So what is a project? Well, a project is a way to develop interest in, some, in a thing or something that you actually already have interest in. It's also a way to develop new skills and potential careers, explore potential careers. Um, we have 45 projects offered in Kansas right now, and so there is something for everyone. No matter what your interest or what your skills are, we can find a 4-H project for you. So, Please like, subscribe, share, and comment on the video to help us reach more people, and we're gonna start exploring those Kansas 4-H projects. I'm gonna start off with the most popular project in the Meredithine District 4-H program, which is the Foods and Nutrition Project. Foods and Nutrition Project members learn how to cook basics and then advance to gourmet and international meals. The Foods and Nutrition Project has many avenues for you to explore, from food preservation, where you can freeze or preserve your food or dry food, to um, favorite food show, where you actually meal plan and develop meal. Uh, you can also discover the health benefits with the health with the nutrition through my plate and many different things. So explore and develop your skills in planning, purchasing, preparing and serving tasty and nutritious meals with the Foods and Nutrition Project. So the next most popular 4-H project in the Meredithine District is our Visual Arts Project. Visual Arts allows members to explore their artistic skills and learn about the elements and principles of design. Whatever art medium you enjoy, you can hone your skills and learn more about it in the 4-H Visual Arts Project. Drawing, painting, leatherwork, ceramics, decoupage, paper crafts, Jewelry making, calligraphy, and many others are yours to explore in the 4-H Visual Arts Project. So our third most popular 4-H project in, our, in the Meredithine District is the Photography Project. Most kids love to take pictures, and that is, makes one, this one of Kansas 4-H's most popular projects as well. Learn about camera equipment, how to create a great image using digital cameras or your phones in this project. Learn how to use the rule of thirds to line up your subject and enhance your photography skills. Continue to develop your skills and explore photography as a hobby or profession in the 4-H Photography Project. So in Kansas 4-H, we've actually changed the names of several of our projects, and one of those projects is one of my favorite projects, the Clothing and Textiles Project. It has now became the Sewing and Textile Design Project, if you're in constructing your clothes, or the shopping and style project if you like to buy your clothes. So the new sewing and textiles design project will introduce you to a whole new world with options of outfits, clothing, and accessories. Make your own outfit or sewing project using patterns you purchased or designed yourself. As you advance in the project, you can develop skills to tailor your sewing to your style and customize it to make it your own. Construct an outfit or item in the sewing and textiles design project. The new shopping in style project allows 4-H members to purchase or have someone else make their outfits. It includes accessorizing your outfit and shopping for the best deal. You can also develop a wardrobe plan to make sure that your clothing fits purchase can be interchangeable with what you already own. Shop till you drop and find the best deals with the shopping in style project. If your favorite channel is HGTV, then I have the project for you. It's the 4-H Interior Design and Architecture Project. This project was formerly called the Home Environment Project and allows you to decorate a room, experiment with colors and textures on your walls, refinish furniture, anything to improve your space. So get your design tools ready and join the Interior Design and Architecture Project. A hallmark of 4-H is community service. If you enjoy learning more about yourself, your family, other cultures, your government, your community at all levels, then you should enroll in the 4-H Civic Engagement Project. Explore other cultures and other countries with civic engagement. 
Do you like to grow things? Do you like flowers and vegetables and fruits? Or maybe you live and work on a farm where you grow crops. We have a project for you. Horticulture Landscape Design is the project for those of you who like to garden and grow flowers, fruits, and vegetables. If you want to learn more about trees and how to identify them, then try the forestry project. Those of you who grow crops need to check out our agronomy project. Develop your green thumb with the horticulture and landscape design, forestry, and agronomy 4-H projects. We offer several 4-H projects that would be considered engineering and technology. If you like to build things and weld, then try out the Ag Mechanics Welding Project. In this project, you can explore the areas of ag mechanics and metallurgy, from repairing and repurposing items to fabrication of new items. Develop your welding and fabrication skills with Ag Mechanics and Welding Project. If you prefer to build and design using building block sets, then try the building block engineering project. Use your building blocks to construct dioramas and explore architectural design in three-dimensional space. Learn and explore the fundamental ideas of architecture with the building block engineering project. Have you ever looked up at the night sky and wondered what the stars and planets are made of? What, are the, what is a constellation? then exploring the 4-H astronomy project is for you. Learn how to use and build a telescope, understand moon phases, locate common stars in the night sky, and explore our solar system and much more. Learn what it means to be an astronomer with the 4-H astronomy project. Another 4-H project we offer is computer science project. If you would like to build and repair computers, or you like to program and design applications, this project's for you. Explore the world of computing with the Computer Science Project. Would you like to build and launch a model rocket? Then check out the Rocketry Aerospace Project. Learn about the latest in aerospace technology and rocket design while building and launching model rockets. The Rocketry Aerospace Project allows you to build a rocket and test its flightability. So, enroll today in the 4-H Rocketry Project. How does a flashlight work? Or what happens when a to make a light come on when you flip the switch. The Electric and Renewable Energy Project encourages you to explore circuits and electricity and renewable energy. From learning about Ohm's Law to building your own electrical appliances such as a lamp or a flashlight, you can explore the world of electricity. Build a simple circuit, design a wind turbine, or test ground outlets in the Electric and Renewable Energy Project. Design and build your own robot and then program it to do certain tasks in the Robotics Project. Whether you're using a kid to build your robot or 4-H junk, 4-H's junk drawer robotics, you can explore the world of robots in the robotics project. The Small Engines project allows you to learn about engines. Learn how to repair, maintain, and rebuild small engines in this project. Send it in drones. In the Uncrewed Aircraft Systems project, you will learn how to pilot drones safely, as well as learning how drones are used and how they can enhance our lives. Learn more about drones in the Uncrewed Aircraft Systems Project. Can you see yourself building a table, a wood toy, or a chair? Then the Woodworking Project is for you. Learn how to read plans and safely build a, wor a wood item while learning about woodworking tools, finishes, and sanding. Explore career opportunities or develop a lifelong hobby with the Woodworking Project. The Communications Project allows you to learn more about the ways we communicate with each other. Develop effective public speaking skills, enhance your writing, or learn how to debate in the communications project. Lights, camera, action. The performing arts project might be for you if you enjoy performing. Dancing, acting, singing, puppets, and clowning are just a few options for your performing arts projects. You can be behind the scenes, helping with costumes, stage settings, and management or makeup, or you can have the spotlight on you as you perform. If the stage is your happy place, then try out the Performing Arts Project. If you like to work with fibers and fabrics, then the Fiber Arts Project is for you. Crocheting, knitting, embroidery, cross stitch, needlepoint, candle wicking, lace work, applique, quilting, rug, rug making, weaving, ethnic arts, and macrame are all a part of this project. Whether you learned spinning wool, new crochet techniques, or how to make a latch hook rug, the Fiber 4-H Fiber Arts Project has it all. Do you love to bicycle? Is camping, hiking, and backpacking one of your favorite activities? Then check out the Health and Wellness Project. 
In this project, you can learn how to, about bicycle safety and repair. You can learn basic first aid and health. You can learn how to camp, or you can learn about recreational games. If you enjoy the outdoors, then the Health and Wellness Project is for you. Take the lead with the 4-H Leadership Project. This project will help you bring out, bring out the best in you. You'll learn about the skills it takes to be a leader, such as understanding yourself, communicating, getting along with others, making decisions, and managing and working with groups. Learn how to become the best leader you can be with the 4-H Leadership Project. If you enjoy a good book, then try the Reading Adventures Project. Learn how to use a library, share a book review, read and report on a series of books, or just track your reading throughout the year in the Reading Adventures Project. The Self-Determined Project is for anyone who has an interest that is not covered by another project. It's the Create Your Own Project Project. It can be anything from bees, cake decorating, basketball, or entrepreneurship. If you have a passion and it's not included in another project, then try the Self-Determined Project. If you'd like to know more about rocks, fossil, and minerals, then try the 4-H Geology Project. Discover more about Kansas rocks, mineral, and fossils, and identify them for your collection. Add to your collection each year, or study different formations across Kansas and other states. The Geology Project really rocks. The 4-H Shooting Sports Project teaches firearm safety as well as competitions. You can learn to, how to safely use an air rifle or a bow and arrow. Start with BB guns and work your way up to air rifles and shotguns. Certified instructors lead the required safety sessions as well as practices throughout the year. Test your skills and learn more about safety with the 4-H Shooting Sports Project. Do you want to learn what animals made those tracks in your backyard? Do you know what species of fish you caught? Then check out the 4-H Wildlife Project. Learn about habitats, identifying dwellings, the characteristics of, life, of wildlife species, or how humans affect wildlife behavior. You can also learn about casting a line, parts of a fishing pole, and what species of fish live in Kansas. The Wildlife and Sports Fishing Project lets you explore the Kansas wildlife. Have you ever chased, have you ever chased butterflies or caught a firefly just to get a closer look? then the 4-H Entomology Project is right up your alley. You will learn about the world of insects by collecting and identifying them in the 4-H Entomology Project. 4-H is known for its livestock projects. We offer many project options from beef, dairy goats, dairy cattle, meat goats, sheep, or swine. You can learn what it takes to raise and manage livestock. From showing to animal husbandry, 4-H Livestock Projects offer you a chance to learn about animal science and agriculture. Raise your own herd with the 4-H Livestock Projects. Love horses? Then this project is for you. You will have the opportunity to learn, handle, care for, and ride horses. Members may own or lease their horse. However, they must manage the horse for 75% of the time. Gallop in to the 4-H Horse Project. 4-H is for more than just farm kids. Our dog project lets you learn about your dog, including how to train your dog in obedience, teach your dog to run an agility course, or participate in dog showmanship. Training sessions are led by leaders throughout the year in the Meridazine District. Learn how to care for your dog in the 4-H dog project. Do you have a pet? Then check out the 4-H pet project. Learn how to care for your household pet and keep them healthy. Get to know your pet with the 4-H pets project. Keep your poultry flock growing with the 4-H Pro Poultry Project. You can learn how to care and handle your birds, raise new breeds, and hatch chicks from eggs you raised. If you'd like to raise chickens, ducks, guineas, turkeys, doves, or pigeons, then enroll in the 4-H Pro Poultry Project. Learn to raise and care for rabbits in the 4-H Rabbit Project. Manage and care for your rabbits and add new varieties and breeds to expand your rabbit herd. With over 200 breeds and varieties of rabbits, you have endless possibilities with the 4-H Rabbit Project. As you can see, the Meridazine District 4-H program has a project for every interest out there. From animal science to natural resources, from communication and expressive arts to engineering and technology, from consumer and family sciences to plant and environmental sciences, 4-H has a project to spark your interest. Join today for more information on how to join 4-H in Miami or Lynn County, Kansas, contact our office at 913-294-4306. 4-H 
4-H has endless possibilities for you and your family. Join today.